from the heart of Indiana, Julie Carey, Chuck Lofton's exclusive AccuWeather. Chuck Lofton. Good evening and wow. Chuck Lofton is. Let me break down this snowy Thursday. There are so many things that Chuck is. You're kind of hung there. Yeah, that's right. There we go. Chuck Lofton is really. Stop. Don't come in, Rain. We don't need you. The Chuckster to me. <laughs> Everybody is, it's Chuck, 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 Chuck. Mickey, this is the honor of my life, getting to meet you, buddy. How is Chuck? Is he as nice as he seems? Sean and Trent, wave hi, boys. Yes, he's as nice as he seems. There you go. Oh, thank you. Chuck Lofton is the heart and soul of our TV station. Hands down, the greatest human being uh, that I know. So Chuck and I have known each other since college when we both were in radio television together. Whenever you're ready, Ron. Chicago Sun at Southern Illinois Chicago University. Shows that the president is now leading Jimmy Carter by... As he would say, back when he had hair. His first job out of college was the NBC station in Evansville, Indiana. He came on board as a news person, as a reporter, but they needed help in the weather department. He said, sure, I'll give that a try, and succeeded to the point where one day the phone rang, would you like to do the weather in the morning here in Indianapolis on our new morning show? He thought, heck, yeah, that sounds good, and he's been doing it ever since. Chuck, let me add my high five as congratulations for your outstanding career. September of 1985, uh, when you came to WTHR television, People didn't realize you were only 15 at the time. That was pretty amazing. But what was also very amazing is all of the talents, how quickly management took advantage of the talents that you displayed. I mean, you got to work 12, 14 hours a day, six, seven days a week. He works ungodly hours in the morning, and I recall a uh, tornado outbreak we had. And we're following this funnel cloud. It did go down in the form of a tornado. That man's out there, you know, Probably on little sleep, he's out there chasing uh, tornadoes, and I couldn't believe it was him. I thought it was someone else. You hear Chuck's voice. When your family ducked for cover. And it's just who he is. Not only does he have the courage to be on air when tornadoes are touching down everywhere, he's had the courage to show up in a groundhog suit and an Elvis costume on the morning news without blinking. Even though he did mention a number of times how it was going to end his career, it still hasn't. Good to see you, my man. Okay, we better do the, <laughs> we do the weather pretty soon. He's a natural in front of the camera. <laughs> Whose hair is this, by the way? Babies tell older people everybody loves Chuck, and he's just been the, the star of the show. You know, he's the personable guy that viewers love to see in the morning, and he's expanded into this wonderful storyteller. He's not just a meteorologist. He's not just a weatherman. We're going to take you far, far away. I think it's an awesome fit. Chuck's big adventure. All right, here we go. He's a natural at it. <laughs> I mean, his laugh. <laughs> his laugh is so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. <laughs> and it's always positive. It's always uplifting. Oh, wow. It's always joyous. Uh, he loves Central Indiana. He loves Channel 13. We love Chuck, and Chuck is Channel 13. been a real pleasure of all the experiences that we have shared and the challenges that we've endured for a number of years. As the song says, we're still standing. You truly embody this award because you want other people to become better and you support that and you strive for that, just helping people become the best selves, and that's why you're so special. 
Chuck works so hard, he works so hard, he works so hard, but he's also all about his family. He loves Mary and the boys and the senator. He's worked really hard, but he's also kept the biggest slice of his pie for his family. And for that, I give him a lot of respect. And Saturday looks as good as it could possibly get here. He's not done yet. He still plans on doing this as long as possible. This is awesome. Because he enjoys it and uh, people enjoy him. And as long as that relationship is there, which I can't imagine it ever um, going away. I mean, Chuck, we'll see Chuck on TV for quite a while.